There are still a number of legal challenges to the travel order still pending in lower courts, including here in Washington. The ACLU of Washington is one of those cases, and it involves a Somali refugee here. So what happens to all of these other individual cases in light of today's decision by the Supreme Court? What's probably going to happen is the Department of Justice will immediately move to say all of these cases should instantly go away. Uh, and I think that there are some very strong legal arguments that that shouldn't happen, uh, that the lower courts should look very carefully at how the administration has actually implemented the waiver system, for example. Are we actually letting any people in from these countries? And more importantly, if we are letting some people in, are we not letting any Muslim people in? So that's something that advocacy groups will be watching closely. ACLU of Washington legal director Emily Chang also told us she's still fighting to move her individual Washington, Washington case forward despite today's ruling. Now let's take